Hi beauties, I'm coming on today to celebrate that I cannot believe I've made a hundred YouTube videos already. It's mind boggling that I actually had a hundred ideas to share with you guys on certain aspects of things that I'm very passionate about. My hair, my makeup, my eyesight, uh, my just being confident and loving yourself and just loving the skin that you're in. So I just wanted to come on and say, yay me. I actually did a hundred YouTube videos. I stayed very, very committed. Um, sometimes I wasn't always so um, on the ball with making my, my, my videos consistent with a consistent um, schedule, but once I became dedicated, I was like, I'm going to really do this because I really love um, recording and the aspects of learning how to edit and use different software because I did not think I was ever a techie person and I'm quickly finding out than I am. <laughs> and even though with some parts of the editing I do get help with, I'm still learning some aspects of it. So I'm so excited and so happy that I proved to myself that I can stick to something and actually work towards a goal. It is only going to get better from here because I have so many ideas that I want to do on this channel and um, grow and reach out to all my beauties and all my subscribers and I'll just share different ideas and have a open dialogue with everyone on social media that happens to stop by my page. So I definitely want to celebrate making a hundred videos and I kind of want to go back to old school YouTube. I understand that a lot of uh, videos have great video camera quality. It's easier to watch. I understand that. But I also enjoyed like five years ago a person just sitting in front of a camera just talking not having anything pre-scripted and just going back to the YouTube roots and I'm all about that I record on an iPhone 6 plus I edit on an app from my phone iMovie there's nothing really high-tech that I do so if you're scared if you've been watching YouTube for years and you're just scared to make that next step of actually recording and get in front of the camera do it you don't have to have the nicest equipment the best lighting i use sunlight i use sunlight <laughs> um if you have the passion and the dedication and you want your voice heard do it i love the old school youtube i love seeing old videos for my um some of my um, beauty bloggers that I absolutely adore, going back on their channel like five years and seeing them just beginning and starting and getting their foot in the door. I love seeing them at that early stage of their very first video being a, a, a little um, shy or whatever. So I'm all for bring back the old, old school YouTube, bring back the grainy video, I guess for me it doesn't really matter since I'm legally blind, but I just, you don't have to have all the high tech from the get-go, guys. If you want to do it, go for it. Um, so I just want to come on and just say that real quick, and I guess I'm actually going to, as you know, my birthday is coming up in a couple of days, um, August 17th, I turned 39 years old, and um, I'll go ahead and show you guys a little small birthday haul of a couple of gifts that have I have received so far. So hold on. <laughs> All right guys, so I just wanna do a really quick birthday haul. Um, I started trying to do hauls, but I don't buy things that often to do hauls that much on my channel. But I thought this was a special occasion since it is my birthday coming up soon. A couple of things that people close to me have given to my birth for me for my birthday already. Um, the first thing I got from a friend of mine, and she knows I absolutely love Hello Kitty, and the first thing I felt, well, the first thing I saw was um, pink, um, was an overwhelming shade that I got when she put it in my hands. And just feeling the texture of the bag, I could tell it was sequins, and she told me it was Belene. And she filled it up with all kinds of goodies. She had a bag of sunflower seeds, and she knows I'm all about my sunflower seeds, old school style, with the shell, so that way I can... Um, spit them out <laughs> so yeah i'm a, a country girl by heart but um this feels like a like a binder so that was and just i mean just anyone giving me gifts just 
thinking about me, I appreciate. So I, I really, really, really appreciate. And her birthday is a week after mine, so I have to make sure that I reciprocate. She's a fan of strawberry shortcake. And uh, this feels like, I, I gotta open it to see, but I'm gonna ask my fiance what this is. And if you didn't know, I, I, I'm legally blind, I don't have no central vision, so yeah. <laughs> Oh, I know what these are. Pencils. And they look like they're different designs. More pencils, it seems like. Uh, these are markers. I, I like to draw. I, I mean, that's part of my... I love drawing. I don't know what this is. What is this? It feels like a yeah, was lip balm. But again, I'll ask my someone what this is. <laughs> and I can tell by the texture this is an eraser. That's very, very cute. So thank you, hon. And actually for this bag, obviously it's like a little small book bag, but I'm not gonna wear it as a book bag. I love Hello Kitty, but I'm they're gonna be 39 years old, so I can't be going outside with a book bag with Hello Kitty. But I'm gonna use this as a makeup bag when I travel, so I thought that was a really cool idea. And I love all the little things you put inside of it. Um, the next thing I got was from my honey, from Target, or Target. And we're going away for my birthday. We're going to Kentucky and there's a beautiful hot tub sauna and a swimming pool there. So he got me a new swimsuit. So the first one is this triangle bikini. It is hot pink. And I need I need um, <laughs> I need support for these bad boys. So um, this one is just like a halter top. That's the best that looks that I feel comfortable in anyway. So it's like a beautiful look. I'm sure the camera's not doing it justice, but it's a beautiful like coral color. And I got some new bottoms that that has like a, a tribal print Aztec print that's very very popular for the last two years as a style and on the sides of the hips it has like a a string banded look for your hips and it's just playing back on the bottoms so very excited to wear that on our trip in the next few days we're going to Kentucky and he also got me something from Macy's. I wanted to try a different moisturizer. The moisturizer I tried recently that I just ran out of was the Alba's moisturizer. It's all natural. I liked it. Um, it wasn't as moisturizing as I wanted it to be. For some reason, my skin still felt dry. And I honestly walk around with a water bottle because when you get older your skin ages the collagen you use some collagen it happens it's the fact of life um i do <laughs> really care about hydration of my skin so i do walk around with a water bottle with cool water it's missed my face periodically to keep it hydrated and i drink lots and lots of water like a like a camel but because my skin is aging and I'm losing collagen, like I said, it's a fact of life, I wanted to try something different from the previous moisturizer. So he bought this from Macy's and I heard so many good things about this. It's the Origins uh, Ginseng. Make sure you guys can see it. And the person I saw gave a really nice review about this and she uses it all the time. Her skin is beautiful. She's a lot younger than me, but her skin is beautiful regardless. It was um, the ugly face of beauty. I love her. I honestly am obsessed. But when I saw her um, do a mini review in one of her videos about this, I was like, I'm definitely going to purchase this and try it. And it smells so wonderful. You can smell the ginger. Um, you can smell like almost a citrusy type of scent to it. And I did try it today. And I must say, it, my makeup application went flawlessly um, on top of it and my skin honestly felt very hydrated. I didn't really have to miss my face as many times throughout the day that I usually do. So, and this cost him um, $27.50. So I only used it once so far, so hopefully it's something that I enjoy and continue to purchase. 
And the last thing I got is a present I got for me. Um, Mac has this nice program. It's called Back to Back. So if you have six empties, six products that you totally empty, they want you to recycle instead of throwing those containers away. You can actually bring those six containers back to a Mac store and they let you get, get a free lipstick. So you definitely want to check your Mac store to see if it's something they do in, in your area. But in Columbus, Ohio, they do do that for us. And it's called the Back to Back program. So. When I went there, I had six empties. Yes, I love Mac. <laughs> and again, um, I saw Ugly Face of Beauty and she recommended um, this color, Mocha. Let's see if it focus. Mocha. If it doesn't, it says Mocha. And it's a beautiful, she says a beautiful, like, nudie pink for darker skin. So I'm going to take this to my trip with me and wear it. I'm so excited. Again, anytime Ugly Face of Beauty reviews a product, she's giving you the straight up blunt truth. If she doesn't like it, she'll let you know why. Um, if she likes it, she will explain again why it works so well for her. So after seeing her review, I definitely knew I wanted this color. And this is my third matte lipstick, so I'm pretty excited about that. Now this one I did purchase. This is the MAC Eyeliner in Black Track. Um, I've been using the Maybelline Eye Studio um, Liquid Eyeliner, Gel Eyeliner, but it really, I just bought this a month ago and it's already dried out. I mean, it, it did a great job, but I also heard really great things about this eyeliner, so I wanted to try it, so I did purchase this myself. And I believe it was like $16.50 or something like that. So, yep, yeah, that's what I got. So, that's all the goodies I have for my birthday. And like I said, I'm going to Kentucky. Um, we're going to the Corvette Museum, and we're just gonna hang out downtown in Louisville. So I'm gonna try to see if I can tip my toe in vlogging and see how that works out. And um, at least do some parts of our trip and show you what awesome things we're gonna be doing during my birthday while we're out of town. So I hope you guys had a wonderful weekend and I will see you next week. Bye loves. And like I always say, be you, stay true, and be natural. Bye.